you guys welcome back to the channel so today i am doing the what's in my gym bag i think it's a tag i don't know is it a tag i just know that a lot of fitness type of channels do the what's in my gym bag but before i begin please do give this video a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe because i make new videos every single week i'm also calling it a gym essentials video these are just my personal things that I find essential to bring to the gym with me. So I thought I would share it with you guys. Let's see. Got a lot going on in this bad boy, okay? What's in my bag? What's in this? What's going on in here? So I actually have two bags that I use. This is my Nike um, drawstring for super light days when I'm going super cash. I don't really need to bring much. But this big baby holds all the valuables, okay? This is, this is all the goods, all the essentials right here, okay? Let me just zip away. All right, guys, I'm just gonna do it grab bag style because that's how I like to do things. I just like to, you know. Okay, first and foremost, you guys, okay? I got some Nike gym gloves. I don't really use them that often, but sometimes, ladies, you know when you're lifting weights, you get them calluses, and I don't mind them so much. It's when they start to tear open and literally sting you while you're in mid squat. I don't know, That's just that just happens to me. My flesh is being ripped open and it hurts. I don't wanna be in pain. Your girl's not trying to be in pain. Woo! You know when I bring the gloves out that it's getting serious. Okay, I think I got them at freaking TJ Maxx for like $8, but I love them. They save my hands, okay? Guys, these are my Beats. I wear them every single day to the gym. <sighs> these I guard with my life. These are my everything right now, okay guys? I got these for free with a MacBook Pro purchase. Got James a laptop for school and I can't even believe they were doing a promotion for free beats or else I wouldn't be owning these today, but they changed my life. They've changed my life around. They don't run out of battery life. They just don't. It takes me a good like two weeks to run out of battery life. And that's going for like an hour, hour and a half uh, for five days a week. These babies are going strong. Okay. I love them. And they just collapse on you and I love it. Okay. Next up, I always, always, always have a headband with me at all times. Okay. This one's Nike. Okay, I like Nike accessories, I guess you can say, obviously. I got my Nike headband for days where I have a really bad freaking hair day. I have very weird hair. Some days I'm just like, wow. And some days I'm like, I hate you. So I gotta put this baby on sometimes. Okay, I just gotta like smooth away flyaways. And... Okay, I don't really wear it like this. I don't, I don't do that. Next guys, oh. Okay, I got myself a jump rope in here because um, I don't know about you guys, but I find it hard to ever find a gym with a jump rope. I feel like I never, they don't have them. <laughs> and I feel like jump roping is just so underrated. It's the one of the best forms of cardio that you could possibly do. And I've been really getting into jump roping a lot more lately. Oh, I'm telling you girl, you do like a straight minute of jump roping and you're gonna just, you're just gonna die. <laughs> All right, I just got this and I wear it every single day. No joke. This is gonna be in my monthly favorites, okay? That's coming up soon, like an active wear favorites. This is, this is gonna be in it. This windbreaker from the brand Avalanche and I got it from TJ Maxx for $25. It's reversible, okay? So if I don't wanna wear black, I can wear gray instead. But love the solid black, hooded, Super lightweight guys, because right now it is summertime and it's hot, very hot out. But I need to be a little conservative when I'm walking around public. But once once you get into the gym, it's game on. But outside of the gym, I like to just kind of zip up. So um, I keep this with me at all times. And after the gym, now that the weather's warm, I love going for long walks. Sometimes it's like right around sunset. Bring this in case I get chilly. Oh yeah. All right guys, <laughs> I keep almonds on me at all times. 
and this is why. Um, there's times where I will get to the gym, by the time I'm out the door, drive to the gym and I park, I will instantly be hungry. And your girl will not, cannot and will not, go to the gym when she's hungry. Okay. I flip from being hungry to hangry real quick. Real quick, ask Bay. Okay, right Bay? Mm. Yeah. Nuts are good for holding you over, especially during a workout. They're really, really good, high in natural fats, high in protein, and it's gonna really hold you over without filling you and making you feel bloated and disgusting. So this is why I pick almonds every single time. They are my go-to pre-workout snack. Yeah, baby. Guys, I love this duffel bag. Okay, you got like a little compartment inside here. Keep your little things in. This is Bay's card. This is his student ID card. Okay, so I always keep his ID on me because, um, well, I wouldn't be allowed into the gym. Okay. I use his ID. I just take it. <laughs> you know? Like, whatever. <laughs> we pay for tuition. You gotta do what you gotta do. This is Bay. Look at how cute. He's so freaky cute. <laughs> what do we got? Oh, all right. Guys, I got some backup headphones. These are just like my Apple headphones that came with my phone. Um, hate them, <laughs> but you need to bring some backups, girlfriend, because just in case yours die. Luckily for me, I, my Beats, they hold strong and not once, and I repeat, not once since I've been using these, have they ever died on me, okay? Nobody likes that. I've been there one too many times, and I don't know. I don't like it. Bring backup headphones because, girl, it's when you don't bring backup headphones is when you're gonna wish you had those backup headphones. All right guys, so next thing I bring with me, and this is only, trust me, I don't wear this fanny pack at the gym, all right? I mean, nothing wrong with that. Maybe one day I will. I actually bring this for when um, I go for a walk afterwards, around the campus, wherever, when it's a nice day, and I'm done with the gym, and I'm ready to do a little outdoor, low intensity cardio. Then I'll bring this out, put my phone in here, Maybe some chapstick, my ID, hands free. I wish I knew what brand this is from, but it is a sports fanny pack. It's made for sports, so uh, it's waterproof, okay? In case you're jogging out in the rain and it's just, you know, downpouring on you, your electronics will be safe and sound. It's got a little back pocket right here. Love, adjustable, and we even got a little compartment up here. Boy, I'll tell you. Fanny packs these days, they're really stepping their game up. But I got it from TJ Maxx and it's like $8. Okay girl, you know fanny packs. Fanny packs. Padlock. Guys, I've had this padlock since I first started getting into the gym. And if you look closely, it's blue, okay? Because I spray painted it blue. I didn't know anything <laughs> about going into a gym. So I assumed that there would be nothing but a whole locker room full of padlocks and I would never be able to tell which padlock was mine. So I spray painted it freaking blue. Not necessary, not necessary. And nowadays they come colored, so. Would you believe that I still forget the combination to this? I have to, I wrote it in my phone now because there's been times where I will, you know, just look like a straight up fool when I'm trying to get my stuff out of the locker and I'm, I'm like, what, what was it? Don't judge, just don't judge. Okay. All right, next up, guys, this is a must. This is, you already knew this was gonna be in here. I got my resistance bands, okay? I got light, extra light, medium, heavy, extra heavy, you name it. Um, this is just like an Amazon brand that James got me. I appreciate it so much, thank you. But I don't like these at all. <laughs> I'm actually in the market um, to get heavy duty resistance bands. So guys, if you have any um, recommendations, really good resistance bands, comment down below please because I would love to check it out because I don't um, I don't like latex. They just roll up on you, okay? I, I, I When I'm just like moving with it, it just, it'll just like, and uh, no, latex and I just, I don't get along. <laughs> Got my chapstick, I love this chapstick, you guys. This is from Burt's. Bees natural, 100% natural tinted lip balm. The color Red Dahlia. I look lifeless 
with not a lot of makeup on my face. <laughs> so this will kind of bring a little life to my face. Yeah, there you go. Okay, so guys, into the shoe compartment right here. Okay, y'all knew, y'all knew this was gonna be in here. These are my Converse, my all-star Converse. These are my leg day, leg and booty day sneakers. These are the only sneakers that I will wear on leg and booty day. And there is a reason. They are super flat, which is actually very, very good for when you squat or any type of compound lower body exercise that you're doing. It's very important to kind of have a flat surface so that when you do squat, you're squatting back into your heels, okay? Now, if you had a normal shoe arched up, you're kind of leaned forward ever so slightly without you even realizing it. It's good to take the arch out and just be flat. For me specifically, I know for a fact that it helps me activate my glute muscles better, okay? Just a little tip. You can take your shoes off in the gym. I did that for a little while before I had these. I don't like doing that because then I gotta sit here, you know, just sitting down trying to put my shoes back on, like I'm sitting here at Payless trying on shoes. I don't like that. When I first ever started getting into lower body exercises, okay? Squatting, specifically. I used to do them in my bedroom with dumbbells with n no shoes on, okay? Because I was in my bedroom, I didn't care, all right? So I went barefoot and I was squatting. That was the best activation I've ever had doing that because I was completely barefoot. And it was the best my glutes have ever looked and I could feel them being activated as I'm pushing up through my heel. So ever since then, um, when I started actually going to a gym to squat, I noticed I wasn't getting that same effect with normal sneakers and went back to like flat, just flat, and uh, it made a huge difference. So if you're somebody who struggles to get some glute activation when you're on leg day, consider your sneakers. Just go as flat as you can, baby girl. Guys, I got protein bars. These are my current favorite right now. They are from the brand Think. I got these from TJ Maxx, whole box for like $8. 20 grams of protein in each. This is in the flavor of creamy peanut butter. They have a lot of different flavors. It is gluten-free and there's zero grams of sugar in here. So that's the thing with protein bars. Whenever I'm really looking for ones, um, like healthy, real, real healthy protein bars with barely anything but protein in it, it's very hard to find and they're usually jam-packed, jam-packed with sugar. So, um, yeah, I like these. I like these a lot for the, like, first five seconds of biting into it, you think you're biting into a Snickers bar, okay? But after the five seconds, that's when the whey protein kicks in and you can really taste that protein flavor. So if you don't like that, I wouldn't suggest these. I'm getting used to it, I don't care. I just need to get my protein, okay? So these I'll usually have after my workout and maybe like right before I'm about to go for a walk. So basic, so freaking basic right now. It's in a Ziploc, look at this. Do I really need to bring this many hair ties? No, no I don't. Guys, I clearly I like to wear braids in my hair. So these little guys are a necessity. You know, the little elastics. There's like hair in it and everything. Got them in right now. Love to wear braids. They're just comfortable for me. And um, less rough on your hair. Especially if you're like sitting in a leg press or something. Uh, your hair's not in a tight ponytail being restricted and like pulling. My hair's very brittle sometimes and it'll snap. So I try to keep it very like loose and not so dangerous for my hair. I got like grown up hair ties right here. All right, just in case. Just want a loose bun or something, I don't know. All right guys, that was it. That was what is in my gym bag and those are just my personal gym essentials. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is just what I like to bring, okay? That just makes my life a little easier, I feel. So give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and do not forget to subscribe because I do make new videos every single week. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.